Sierra Leone is located in West Africa. It is a beautiful country blessed with spectacular landscapes, rich culture, and incredibly resilient people striving to recover from the devastating effects of civil war and more recently Ebola. Since 2008, CRS has been working closely with local communities to improve the quality of life through the USDA funded food for education program. My name is Binti Samura, and I live here in Sinkunia community. I have four children going to the school. My children are really happy to be going to school now. Before, it was difficult to get children to go to school, but since the feeding program started, the school is now full of students. The Food for Education project operates in five of the hardest to reach areas in Kwanadugu district, providing daily meals and support to 192 schools and approximately 32,000 school children. The program is helping to address some of the challenges, including low enrollment, poor attendance and retention, low pass rates, and lack of teaching and learning materials. We're providing service training to nearly 800 teachers, support teachers in reaching qualification standards, and improve the school infrastructure by working with local communities to construct classroom blocks, latrines, and water wells. I'm glad you for CRS. I'm really happy CRS are here. Before, I can say we were like a stone sinking in water. But now, the education has improved. It's really improved. Since we then come, it encourages the children to come to school, and now they actually want to learn. The food is really helping, because when a child is hungry, they aren't going to be listening. But after they eat, they will sit down and pay attention in class. CRS provides through USDA the rice, lentils, and vegetable oils. And the program strategy is to ensure that communities are also actively involved. So there's a strong community participation component of the Food for Education program. Now from day we the get We the community grow the vegetables and the peppers ourselves. CRS do their part and we do our part. All the mothers are happy to contribute because we are so happy to see our children going to school. When I go into these communities, I see uh, how excited kids are in, in school, how drawn they are to school because of the food we provide, and how appreciative communities are, especially the women who recognize the importance of education. The project has taught us elders that these children are our future leaders. We need to make sure they all go to school. We now know that education is the key to their world.